The Adventures of China Iron by Gabriella Cabasson Camara, translated by Iona McIntyre and Fiona McIntosh. Part one, the Pampas. It was the brightness of the light. The young pup radiating life was scampering excitedly between the dusty sore paws of the few dogs left round there. Poverty yields cracked skin. It carves and slowly scrapes away at its young and leaves them to fend for themselves in all weathers. It makes skin dry, leathery and scarred and forces its offspring into unwanted shapes. But not yet the pup. It radiated sheer delight at being alive and gave off a light undimmed by the dingy sadness of a poverty that was, I'm sure, as much a lack of ideas as anything else. <laughs> 